Hello, hello. Good afternoon, everyone, and beautiful midweek to you all. I am obviously in front of a pool, a saltwater pool to be exact, in front of this beautiful house. I will obviously show you inside in a little bit. And I know it's hard to tell by that, but it is huge. Um, it was supposed to be a four, uh, four bedroom, but they actually switched it to a three because there's three en suites. So not often do you even see two en suites, let alone three. So your kids don't have to fight over the bathroom. They each get their own en suite, which is amazing. Oh yeah, I have to forgot. I have to swipe that. Um, hi, Chris. Hi, Justin. Um, so three en suites at this property and the taxes, which is amazing for Essa which is why I love Essa. The taxes are less than $3,000 for this huge house, okay? So $29.78 the taxes are. And the square footage is $21.23. I peaked. <laughs> so beautiful. Hi, Justin. Um, this pool, amazing. It's obviously not the sunniest today, um, but you can still see how gorgeous it is. And they've done tons of interlocking work. There's this cute little... Oh, yeah, that's a... You know, it's hooked up to natural gas there. Um, it is mind-blowing, Justin. So a uh, cute little fire pit area. And just behind the corner is where the heater and everything is for the pool. And this whole section that I'm standing on is all interlocked. And there's also landscaping in the front. There's this adorable little area um, over here. I'll try and get out of the shot. And there is um, power there. So they have a little fridge and everything. But I will turn it around, um, but I just wanted to say like the main bits about the house. The house has nine foot ceilings and it has California shutters everywhere. Like I said, three en suites. The master bedroom has his and hers walk-in closets. And then one of the other bedrooms also has a walk-in closet. Plus, like I said, three en suites. Which I just keep repeating it because it's amazing. <laughs> um, there is quartz countertops. Um, they've updated all the fixtures and the hardware in the house. And um, there's an amazing dog wash area, which I'm going to show you the dog wash area. No sidewalk, so four cars fit. And I apologize if I repeat stuff, just because I do. Um, hi, Melissa. Hi, Scotty. Um, it is a stunning backyard. Um, so, yeah, that's the main gist of it. There's, like, pocket doors, um, inside garage entrance, second floor laundry. Um, but I will shush it now and I will show you guys around okay hi Courtney okay where's my turnaround button I forget there okay so gorgeous interlocking and it's a huge huge area right so we have this little covered pergola and it has the um, power like I mentioned so they have a little bar fridge there everything's really meticulously maintained um, they have little gardens and the gates cute over there they have solar lights all the way around the pool. And again, the taxes on this house are less than $3,000. Hi, Jeff. Hi, Christina. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Darren. Darren, today we are at 77 Mount um, in Essa. I should say the thing. It's Crescent. 77 Mount Crescent. That's an oversized um, sliding door. And um, this house, I know I keep saying it, but it's just because I love that it has three en suites. Okay, so beautiful saltwater pool. And I will uh, head inside. I'll, I'll uh, not trip on these pebbles here and see like the massive interlock area. And then there's this cute little fire pit area. Adorable backyard, all fully fenced, obviously. And again, it has second floor laundry, this really wide slider, which goes right into the eat-in kitchen, um, as well as the living room. So nice, bright, and open. So obviously nine-foot ceilings in here, pot lights. So there's quartz countertops, a nice island, and they did a lot of updating with the, or upgrading, I should say, with the builder. So not only is there a sink there that looks out onto the backyard and love those subway tiles, um, but also there's a sink in the uh, island. They have gas stove, obviously all stainless steel appliances. Cute little coffee area over there. Hi, Douglas. It's just nice and open. 
No carpet here, so bright throughout. Pot lights in the uh, living room with a nice, you know, obviously uh, wall-mounted TV. California shutters, gas fireplace. And the California shutters are throughout the house, not like in just in this one room or anything, okay? So super adorable area. You like the white and gray, I know. It's very, you know, just goes with everything. Like sometimes I see funky, I'm like, oh, that's fun for like a week, but not forever. <laughs> so love this cute space. And it's really, really big. Okay, so you're not feeling cramped. You could put a massive sectional in here if you wanted, overlooking obviously the great backyard. And then of course the lovely kitchen. And I'm not gonna like pull out their drawers or anything, but they have, you know, like those garbage things that pull out that are all built in. Um, I'm a girl, but I love these sparkles in this. I don't know if you can see it with the light, but it's all sparkly. And again, they spent tons of money on upgrades in this kitchen. They're original owners to this house, so it's nice it hasn't changed hands a million times. It's a lovely neighborhood. Hi, Kevin. Kevin, I saw your post this morning in Ibiza. Isn't it a pretty kitchen, Douglas? So this house is 2,123 square feet. Hi, Catherine. And the lot's 49 by 114. Love those double front doors. So the house is freshly painted. Again, they've changed all the lighting fixtures. They have transom windows above uh, the regular windows, plus, like I said, the California shutters throughout. And again, we don't have carpet, which is super nice, you know, for the kids and so forth. But nice and bright in here. And this is obviously an eight-person table. And there's still lots of room. So they still have room for a hutch or what have you. And again, we are at 77 Mount Crescent in Essa. There is, I'll go outside after, but there's a cute covered um, porch out there. I don't know if you can kind of see it through there. But it's covered, so... It's raining, you want to, you know, read a book, have a glass of wine. It's super cute. Um, a lot of things I repeat, so I apologize just because some people come on at different times. So, um, for example, like I saw when Catherine came on. Um, so Catherine doesn't know there's three en suites in this house. So Catherine has th um, two children. I almost said three. Catherine <laughs> has two children. Hi, Sarah. And each child could have their own en suite if you lived in this house. So... Every kid has their own ensuite. There's second floor um, laundry, which is a great feature. And then the master has uh, two walk-in closets, plus one of the other bedrooms has a walk-in closet. So second floor laundry. So downstairs where it was supposed to be laundry, that's where they have the doggy wash area. And um, they paid to have this upgraded to move up here. I think, Catherine, your kids would love it, but obviously they're still little, so they might not realize how lucky they are. <laughs> um, so we're in the master. So again, the California shutters stay throughout, and we have the pot lights. They have a big king bed, and there's still tons and tons of room. You could easily have, you know, a chair or something. Um, And this overlooks the backyard. So you can watch the kids in the pool if you happen to be upstairs grabbing something. And then you go through to the master bath. You have his and hers walk-in closets. Okay. Um, and this tub was redone. So beautiful. Obviously, we have ceramics in here. This house is only five years old. I forget. I don't think I told you that. So it's only five years old. And it's been listed for less than two days. And the reason I'm doing this live today and not on the weekend is because we've had so much interest in the property and people didn't want me to wait for the weekend. So I am here today. Hi, Danny. So you have, you know, his and hers vanities or hers and hers or his and his, no judgments. Um, I'm just used to saying his and hers. Uh, California shutters, obviously, throughout, like I mentioned. And again, like I said, we're overlooking the backyard and the pool. And, oh, that's me. <laughs> um, so, for those that didn't hear, the taxes on this are less than 20, uh, sorry, less than 3,000. They're 29.78, which is amazing for the size of a house. So, three bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms. Thanks, Danny. It is very beautiful. Hi, Tara. Tara, can you imagine if you gave the kids their own bathroom? They would never leave. <laughs> 
Tara has some kids at home, too, and then some older ones moved out, and a granddaughter. Uh, so this is an ensuite in one of the kids' bathrooms, and the thing that I love besides it has ensuites is that they are four-piece, they're not three-piece, okay? So remember I said they've updated all the hardware, so they've done all the handles, all the hardware, like in the showers and everything, they haven't left anything, you know, the builder, not to be rude, but sometimes the builder does junky stuff. I know, Terry, you want them to move out, so don't then give them ensuites because they will probably never move. <laughs> uh -huh. But they're also younger. What are they? They're now, I want to say 15 and 16. Hi, Penny, how are you? Penny just sold her house and is moving to a beautiful house. Um, I, I don't even know what you would call that area. This is a neat, like, Juliet that looks down to below. So we have the transom again, the California shutters, so that goes down to the lovely front door. 1816, wow. I was kind of close. I can't believe he's 18. <laughs> so this is another one of the kids' bedrooms. So this flooring has been updated. This was not done by the builder, so that's nice that they've um, not left the builder stuff. Um, just waking from night shifts. Oh, I hope you had a good sleep, Penny. It is a very nice layout, Scotty. <laughs> Tara, I will not jump. So there's a cute little area for homework. Uh, I am very well, thank you, Penny. It's a bit cooler today, which is actually kind of nice. Have the air off, have the windows open. So all of this has been freshly painted. That is a walk-in closet. So again, we're not obviously in the master. However, we have a bathroom because there's three en suites in this home which is amazing. And again, they are um, all, all bath showers, you know, not three piece. That's actually the same color. It looks like a different color, but it's just the lighting. I don't even know. It, I swear with my eyes, it's the same color. <laughs> but with the video, it does not, but it's the same color. So again, three bedrooms up here, California shutters throughout. It's 77 Mount. And this house has been listed for less than two days. It's listed for seven hundred and nineteen thousand, and again the um, taxes are less than three thousand, which is awesome. They're twenty nine seventy eight, and the square footage is twenty one twenty three, not counting the basement. And it does have a saltwater pool, and the lots forty nine by one fourteen. I'm gonna go show you guys the doggy wash area next. I'm just redoing up here. Um, again, this is one of the kids, so both kids get their own ensuite. If you had three kids and everybody wanted their own room, you could, you know, somebody could be in the basement. Um, again, upper floor laundry, and that is, a, looks like a quartz. Yeah, a quartz. So it's nice they didn't cheap out and, you know, do something, not to be rude, but laminate there. Because <laughs> it's obviously a beautiful, high-quality home. Again, just in the master Hot lights, huge space, uh, his and hers walk-in closets, or again, like I said before, hers and hers, or his and his, but I'm just used to saying that. This has been redone, this is not from the builder. Um, separate shower, and then dual vanities is really nice. I'm not showing myself in the mirror that time, a little bit. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you guys the amazing doggy wash area. So say you have a four-legged friend and you come back from a walk because there is a doggy park out here in Essa. You love the tub and the master, Dougie? Do you love those doors? I love those doors. So again, all the lighting fixtures have been done. It's a lovely master. So extra closet space, nobody ever complains about that. This is just to the powder room but it is a pocket door. So that is cute and that was done. That was not from the builder. Yeah, I know you would love those doors. That's why I was saying it, Douglas. <laughs> so a little powder room's cute. And this is the amazing doggy wash area. Isn't this adorable? So this would have been a laundry area, but they paid to upgrade and they put this super cute doggy wash area. It's probably I don't know, maybe three, three and a half feet high. So love the tiles. 
you know, even they have the um, quartz little, I don't even know what you call that, lip edge, I don't know what it's called, but it's super, super cute, so you can, you know, wash your dog, or even if you have, like, muddy feet or something, or stinky kids playing hockey, I have no idea, <laughs> you can put all your little doggy stuff up there, it is so smart, it's adorable, uh, yeah, Douglas, you can wash your puppies, but I think you only have one, I always forget, because the one passed. Um, so that goes into the garage. I don't need to show you in there. That is um, a double garage. And that goes to the lower level. So the lower uh, basement's not finished, so we don't need to go down there. There is a rough in for a bathroom down there. Hose down the husband. See, that's, I know, that's what I'm saying. So I will um, show in here one more time and then I will go up front. Okay, so beautiful kitchen. Again, this is 719 five years old, listed for less than two days in Essa at 77 Mount Crescent. Hi, Sean, how are you? In uh, Eden Kitchen here, there's also a formal dining room. Living room is super bright and open, uh, you know, obviously looking into the backyard as well as the kitchen where I was just standing. Salt water, in-ground pool with tons of interlocking space. Um, and the dining room, I'll go back over here. Pretty shiny, I, I don't know, I say sparkly. Pretty sparkly <laughs> quartz countertops. Love the backsplash. And then we have the formal dining room in here. Hi, Yana. Love the picture of Avery and your dad the other day. It was super sweet. So they've done all the lighting fixtures. So I will show you guys outside. Apologize while I get my shoes. So they also have keyless entry, which is handy. You, you know, you go for a walk with the dogs or um, a run or something and you don't have to take your keys with you. Um, that is just for safety. We have people um, put on gloves and masks before they come in for showings. Um, so this is the covered porch that I was talking about. It's adorable. Like I said, have some wine out there. Hi, Nikita. I believe, Nikita, you live in uh, Essa as well. I don't know, I'm just saying because um, Stacy and Kyle do, so I'm assuming, but I think you do. Um, so I'm actually possibly near you, Nikita, at 77 Mount Crescent. Um, Yana, it's at 77 Mount Crescent in Essa, or Angus, whatever you want to call it. I call it Essa. The taxes are less than $3,000. they are $29.78. And so, as you can see, there's no sidewalk. So you can park four cars in the driveway. And this isn't a through street, so you don't have any traffic going by. Nobody's whipping by you or anything. It's super adorable, obviously, curb appeal. Um, I even love, like, the hardware on the garage doors are nice. Not to be rude to the neighbors, but they don't have it. See? Not to be rude. But they don't. Look at, look at the garage doors. <laughs> Hi, Brenda. So, yes, this 77 Mount Crescent in uh, Essa. And this house is 719. Um, 719. It's five years old. It has, I guess I should show more of the house. Um, 77 Mount. It has been listed, listed for less than two days. Um, it is only five years old. Cute little, um, sitting area in there. And I was saying, because I know some people have been on at different times, that there's three en suites, which is awesome and not very common. And a saltwater pool, nine foot ceilings. Um, they've updated all the lighting fixtures, all the hardware. There's hardware, uh, hardwood upstairs, going up the stairs, I should say. There's no carpet anywhere. Um, the lights have been done. It's been freshly painted. There is a doggy wash area, um, saltwater pool, second floor laundry, um, beautiful ensuite with um, his and hers vanities as well as his and hers walk-in closet. Um, is it going to sell to you, Catherine, today? Um, I actually don't know, Catherine, where you're living now. I know where you used to live. Um, so super cute um, and functional, to be honest. It has all the pot drawers. I don't know if you can see that pot drawers. I'm going to go outside again. Um, that is my favorite wall in the whole house. I love that wall. It's so cute. And I actually love these big sliders. And I'll show from out here. It has the transom window above it. Um, so it's just nice because there's tons of natural light. So I will turn it around again so you guys can see the backyard. Thanks, Nikita. 
Nikita, do you live in Essa? So adorable little, you know, hangout area. They have uh, power so you can have, you know, a bar fridge or whatever you want out here. They have gas hookup so you never have to lug your propane tanks around. And again, this house is 719, um, 21, 23 square feet. And the taxes are less than $3,000. So huge house, California shutters everywhere, and um, like I said, saltwater pool. So it's just awesome for the kids. You know, they say staycation, you know. Um, oh, you do. See, so maybe I'm close to you. And then there's a cute little fire pit area over here. And then the heating stuff for the pool is tucked beside, and it is a saltwater pool, um, not chlorine, okay? Um, that's pretty much it. Basement is unfinished. But because there's so much upstairs, unless you have a ton of kids, you probably don't need the basement finished. Um, but this wasn't even like, you know, some people do interlock and they do it themselves and they shouldn't have. This is like obviously professionally done. There's nothing's like uneven. It was obviously tamped properly. It's beautiful. Um, I will go back inside for those people that didn't see before. And I don't want to be in that shot, but <laughs> this is a extra wide slider with the transom upstairs or not upstairs above hi Amy I hope you and Britt are well Amy we are in Essa Amy lives east of east end of Toronto we're in Essa right now um, at 77 Mount and this house is 719 this house where you live would probably be like 1.5 or 1.8 um, which is the joys of living up here cheap taxes and you can easily commute or just work around here or just not work as much because your mortgage is less beautiful kitchen pot lights the island has its own sink uh, no carpet anywhere in this house obviously all the appliances stay which are stainless all the lighting fixtures stay all the California shutters stay there's a really cute living room with pot lights, nine foot ceilings. And again, this lot is 49 wide by 114 deep. And there to the basement, which is unfinished, is that way. We have lots of storage, big foyer. We have a cute little powder room with a um, pocket door. And then this adorable little doggy wash station. I'll go upstairs one more time. So cute dining room. Amy, are you guys going to go um, camping at all this summer or is it not ideal for you? They're still open. I know that they're still open. Amy and I have been camping many times. Um... Oops, I hit my elbow, sorry. <laughs> Upper floor laundry, uh, which is lovely with quartz countertops. And this goes into the master, which is double doors to the master, which is huge. Hi, Jasmine. Again, taxes on this house. Those are both uh, walk-in closets. Taxes on this house are less than $3,000. Hi, Christine. I didn't see that you were on here. How are you? So there are double vanities. Sorry. <laughs> the nice soaker tub. And this is not um, from the builder. That's been done separately. So beautiful marble around there. Christine, we're in Essa at 77 Mount, and this house has three en-suites. So Brock could have his own en-suite, and then whoever comes to visit you could have their own en-suite, which is nice. There's this lovely, like, upper area um, that has a Juliet to down below. And then this is one of the kids' or spare bedrooms, depending on who I'm talking to at the moment. Uh, and like I said, everybody has their own four-piece ensuite. Isn't it amazing that they all have ensuites, Christine? Christine is in cold water. And she is fantastic. She's at Georgian, works at Georgian College. 
and our parents have big curve acres. So if you guys, I don't even know, is Big Curve Acres open, Christine, or is it closed right now? So if you guys want to take the kids and have a fun day, Big Curve Acres has tons of animals. They even have a camel. So four piece, um, four piece in every ensuite, except the master has even bigger than four piece, five. That's a walk-in closet. And that is, oh, closed, boo. Sorry, you can't go to Big Curve Acres right now. I lied, it's closed. However, in the future. <laughs> so nice foyer, love those doors. Hi, Tanya, hi, Donna. Donna, thank you for entering all the contests. Transom windows above here. Transom. You should see the animals with Christine Douglas. Beautiful um, dining room. Again, no carpet anywhere in this house. And again, this house is 77 Mount and it's listed for 719. It is only five years old and it's been listed for less than two days. Gorgeous property, uh, inside and out. No sidewalk out front so you can park four cars. Has that amazing dog wash area. And of course this amazing pool. And then a cozy spot for your friends. You could put some stuff down here too if you wanted. Um, there's tons of space really. Anyways, a beautiful, beautiful spot. Again, 77 Mount, listed for 719 um, saltwater pool. And this house is, like I said, five years old, been listed for less than two days. And I've gone around the house twice. So I think that's probably sufficient. I hope you guys are all well. Uh, I have a Facebook Live tonight at 6 for a weekly update of real estate in Simcoe County. And then again, Friday at 1045, I have a live at a different house. If you guys are around, check it out. Have an awesome day. Lots of love. Sorry, Kendra, you're just getting on. I'm leaving. Have an amazing day. Bye, guys.